Once upon a time, in a land far, far away, there lived a friendly dragon named Sparky. Sparky was different from other dragons. He didn't breathe fire, he breathed sparkles. One sunny morning, Sparky was flying through the sky when he saw a little girl named Lily playing in the meadow. Lily was skipping and laughing, her bright pink dress swirling around her. Sparky couldn't resist joining in her fun. Hello, little one, Sparky said, his voice like a gentle rumble. Would you like to go on an adventure with me? Lily's eyes widened with excitement. Yes, please, Mr. Sparkly Dragon, she squealed. So, Sparky swooped down and landed next to Lily. They held hands, and with a flap of his wings, they soared into the blue sky. They flew over shimmering rivers, sparkling lakes, and lush green forests. Sparky loved showing Lily the beauty of the world from his high-flying perch. As they flew, they met a silly squirrel named Scruffy, who couldn't stop chattering. They played hide-and-seek with a mischievous rabbit named Hop, and even had a tea party with a tiny, talking mushroom named Ollie. But their adventure was far from over. Suddenly, they heard a loud roar in the distance. Oh no, Lily cried. What's that? Don't worry, Sparky said. That sounds like my grumpy cousin, Blaze. He's always getting into trouble. Blaze was a grumpy, fire-breathing dragon who lived in the nearby mountains. He didn't like anyone, especially sparkly dragons like Sparky. Sparky and Lily flew towards the sound of the roar. As they approached Blaze's cave, they saw him guarding a pile of shiny gold coins. Hey, Blaze, Sparky called out. What are you doing? Blaze turned around, his fiery breath steaming his nostrils. Leave me alone, Sparky. This gold is mine, but you don't need it, Lily said. There's so much more to life than treasure, Blaze laughed mockingly. You just don't understand. Gold is everything. No, it's not, Sparky said firmly. The real treasure is making friends and having adventures. Blaze didn't believe them. He opened his mouth and was about to breathe fire at Sparky and Lily when Lily had an idea. Wait, she shouted. I have something for you. Lily reached into her pocket and pulled out a handful of colorful crayons. Crayons? Blaze asked, confused. Yes, Lily said. You can draw with them. It's so much fun. Blaze blinked his big fiery eyes. He had never seen crayons before. Hesitantly, Blaze took the crayons from Lily. He held them in his claws and ran his tongue over the different colors. Hum, Blaze said. This doesn't taste like gold. It's not supposed to taste like gold, Lily giggled. Just draw with them. And so Blaze began to draw. At first, he scribbled and smudged, but then something magical happened. He discovered the joy of creating something beautiful. As Blaze drew, the pile of gold coins next to him slowly disappeared. Instead, there were drawings of flowers, rainbows, and even a picture of Sparky and Lily flying through the sky. Blaze looked at his creations in amazement. He had never felt so happy before. Wow, Blaze said, this is, this is incredible. Thank you. Sparky and Lily smiled. They had showed Blaze that there was more to life than gold. They had given him the gift of imagination and joy. From that day on, Blaze became a different dragon. He gave up his treasure and spent his time creating beautiful drawings that brought happiness to everyone he met. And Sparky and Lily continued their adventures, always finding new friends and spreading laughter and kindness wherever they went.